So it's all right. They don't bother me much. I keep a little profile around them. So you have, like, rent-a-parent? Foster parents. I know people are pretty cool. I'd love to train my name for a new set. Maybe not. Most of them don't come with mansions and clothing allowances. Ashley right here. This is the home of the world's greatest chili burgers. I knew it. I knew it. They're going out. You have two or three of these babies and you are set. Beautiful. What'll it be, kids? Hey, don't you know that cigarettes are bad for your health? Not to mention illegal and food service establishments. <laughs> Great, another couple of geniuses enter my world. What do you want? I'll have the tuna salad. No, wait, no, no. She'll have two of your chili joy burgers. I'll have two also with uh, some of, um... <laughs> what do you call it? <laughs> They're loaded. Not cool. I'm gonna run it by you one more time. I wanted extra cheese on one, but not extra on the other. You're getting a little loud. I am not getting loud. I'm just trying to make a point. On Dylan, this... Dylan, Dylan. Take it easy. You know him? Yeah. Get him out. What about the burgers? Like you? Man, just tell him to. All right, Hunter. There to go. Let's go. And Hunter, let's, let's go on the shirt. These would make a very attractive couple. Uh huh. get them home. No, not in my car. Why not? Dylan's looking a little green. <laughs> hey, isn't that your brother? Oh, hey, bro. Hey, man. <laughs> That's why you can't ride in the car. Charming. If I didn't know any better, I'd say my little brother was drunk. <laughs> <laughs> It's not good. Mike! I love you. You hammered. No, I only had a little bit. All right, uh, things seem to be under control here. Let's go. What a waste of a night. I get all dressed up and have nowhere to go. We just got to see Dylan and Ash's view. Yeah, that was the girl. I can't believe we couldn't find the rain. Whatever. Next time, you just need better sources. Next time? Yeah, maybe we can do this again. Maybe. Mom's ready for church. Go get in the car. Dylan's not coming with us today. Okay. the aspirin. Right hand shelf, like always. Mike Roberts dropped you off late last night. What did he say? He wants you to pay to have the upholstery in his car cleaned. Oh, no. Yes. What were you thinking? Drinking? Going out? Are you crazy? Mom! No, don't mom me. I come home, I find two empty bottles of wine, and I have no idea where you are. What is wrong with you? But I... No! How many times do I have to tell you that when anger turns to worry, you are in big trouble? I'm sorry. Worst part is that I like Dylan. I've come to trust him. 
I wish I could blame him for this. But you can't. Please, this was my fault. I know, that's the problem, Ash. I thought you were a lot smarter than this, but you are totally out of control. I am not. I just had one little sip, and then one thing led to another, and... All right, get to the bathroom. Do not miss the toilet. Hello? Hey, Jermaine. You are not gonna believe what happened. Yeah, I heard. Dylan, you were supposed to meet me last night. Jermaine, relax. We could go see the movie tonight. No, it's not the way it is. I'm not having it. Later. Jermaine. Here, drink this. Never thought I'd have to keep liquor in this house under lock and key. You don't. I'll never touch the stuff again. Well, that's what everybody says the morning after. So just for the record, for the next month, there will be no dates, no parties, no going out on weekends. Just school, you, and me. Hello? Hey, Mrs. Gordon. It's Dylan. Hi. Ashley can't talk right now. Please, Mom. All right. Just keep it short. 